Hello everybody, I'm Jeff from Missouri Wind and Solar and I want to show you a new product that we've come up with uh, for our wind turbines and it's called a yaw bearing. Um, if you've had a, if you've got a wind turbine, you've probably seen this mount a lot out there on the market. It's very popular and this is like our mount. Um, they don't have a yaw bearing so what we have done with our wind turbines is we supply a locking collar with them, with a lot of them, and we use a nylon washer and that allows the mounting bracket to slip around very easy and we just come up with something new that's a lot better than the nylon washer. Okay this is what the bearing looks like and it's something we've come up with and it's zinc plated. Now you probably have seen these out there on the market and they're not zinc plated, they're bare steel and they will rust. So we had these zinc plated and I believe we're the only ones that's got them zinc plated. So consists of just a bearing, it's a thrust bearing and two washers and I'll show you how it works. Okay now this is how it works. This is your wind turbine tower. Take the locking collar, we sell these things, slide it down, just snug it up, not real tight, get it where it's supposed to go. And next, you just simply take one of the washers, drop on the pipe, you drop the bearing down on the pipe, and the next lock washer. What you want to do is grease this bearing up pretty good. Just get some grease on it. Um, axle grease, high temperature grease, or marine grease is actually best to use marine grease. Okay, next, slide our wind turbine down over the pipe. Okay, now I've got the wind turbine down on the tower, and you notice how much space I've got up here? Get this top plate right here, about an eighth of an inch off the top of your pole. Don't let this rest on the top of your pole. Now, it's pretty easy to do. Now then what you do is take this uh, hose clamp. Okay, just tighten up the hose clamp and this actually just keeps the wind turbine from coming off the tower. And this is all you need up there. Now the bearing, it's installed, I got it greased up, we'll see how it works. You're going to see how smooth that bearing works. Now the guys have already got this bearing, they've stuck it on their wind turbine and for as little as one mile per hour wind We'll get this wind turbine to track into the wind. Now that's what guys have told me. One mile per hour and it is tracking in the wind. Now granted it's not producing any power, but you can see how easily this thing turns. Isn't that sweet? So this is a really, really inexpensive upgrade. Um, I don't like giving prices on YouTube videos because years down the road the price can go up or the price can go down. But right at the moment they're about ten bucks. And we're the only ones that have the zinc plated models and you cannot buy these in stainless steel. Um, anyway, if you've got very turbulent wind in your, and you got this up in your backyard around trees, really turbulent wind and your wind turbine doesn't track uh, not very well this bearing here will get it to track beautifully into the wind. So, I'm Jeff from Missouri Wind and Solar, and thanks for watching.